Hi, Skyrich Egg here, and I'm going to be playing Proteus, which is an indie game. Um, I'm a big fan of indie games, and this one looked pretty cool. Uh, I don't know that much about it. I know it's kind of a game about exploration, um, and that it has, I don't know, some sort of hidden stuff in it. Uh, the way it was described to me originally is that it has an end game, so there's some sort of progression in the game. Um, I briefly went in once already just, just to look around, and um, then I came back out here because it looked cool enough that I thought I might record it. Um, I, don't, I don't know how long this game takes, but um, I'm, I'm going to explore around a while and let you see. I also don't know, some of this might be too much spoiling, so if once you see a little bit of the game and you think it looks pretty cool um i'll leave a link and you can go check it out for yourself and not have to watch me ruin the complete <laughs> the whole game for you so i'm gonna go ahead and get this started it takes a little while to load so i'll, I'll probably keep talking during this time but it has a cool little loading screen where the little letters fade away kind of slowly um basically i guess it's creating a whole world kind of like minecraft i think it's procedurally generated or something but it's it's really beautiful it's 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 a it's different than minecraft but it has some similarities in that you know there's exploration of this world but uh it's more of just kind of an experience um and less of a game than minecraft is uh so you just mostly go around and kind of look at the beautiful things and uh, the, the best thing I noticed about so far is I really like the music in this game. Um, I really like the music in FTL as well um, which adds a lot of atmosphere but this game has a lot of great atmosphere from what I've been able to tell so it looks really cool. So I think it should be starting here soon hopefully. Um, but yeah it's Exploration indie games I, I like a lot. I like games with a lot of atmosphere in them. Um, and I, I like experimental games somewhat. I don't, I don't like love experimental games. I need them to have a little bit of purpose. Um, but I can definitely like certain aspects of an experimental game. And this one has some some of those kind of aspects but it's just so dang beautiful and the music is really nice so apparently i'm just you know playing a a black screen here <laughs> yeah it, it takes a little while to load i guess my computer's not as beast as it should be because i want to get in it'll load eventually i'm not too worried here we go right here i wake up Oh, it's raining. I also don't know where the shore is. Before I could see the shore, I guess I'll just start going in one direction. can't even see myself moving. There's nothing in relation, really. Really hope I find some land. See, before, I could see a bit of land. But now I don't I don't see any of that, so I'm just gonna start heading this way. Am I even moving? I have no idea. Well, looks like this oh, there's some land. This game is sky rich egg out in the middle of the ocean. Okay. Man draw distance is not very good. I, I thought I had more before. Maybe just because it's raining. A little more foggy. Aw, this is pretty. <laughs> nice little woods. Might be quiet a lot in this game, actually, and just let you guys enjoy it. But I found these things before, and they make a little noise and make the trees go crazy.
Now, the archaeologist in me wants to know why are these monoliths here? Why would someone come and erect these stones in this kind of pattern? What kind of culture was this? And my guess, other than the, if there wasn't the noise that they'd make when you walk past them, it'd be, you know, some sort of border. But because it's a noise, I'm going to go with the, the old archaeologist standby. It has ritual purposes. Anyways, hey, look, a path. Yeah, when I, when I was playing this before, it wasn't as foggy. There's like, I can't see anything right now. I thought I put the view distance to high. Huh. I love the music. It's like tingling with the rain. Look, a hill. Hmm, these ones aren't making a noise. Okay, see, this is more like what it looked like before. Nice and open. There's the sun. It's like a desert mountain top. Huh, what are those things? What is that? It's like a ruined tower. That's interesting. Let's check it out. What's that noise? Whoa, 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 what just happened? Whoa, whoa. Um, what the crap? This isn't, what? This is not where I was. Wait a second. Whoa. Whoa. Oh. Okay. Huh. That's interesting. So, these things kind of suck you in a little bit if you get too close to them. And then it goes black, and then you're, like, somewhere else. That's pretty interesting. This is, like, teleporter towers. That is very cool. Too bad I can't, like, go inside it. That'd be pretty sweet. Wow, this is a pretty big island. Well, I don't even know if it is an island. Whoa, what are those things? Like people or trees up there? So it's nighttime, that's pretty. Let's head up. Let's head up here. I'm pretty much completely lost. I don't even know which direction I came between that teleporter and wandering around. Oh, what the heck are these things? That is kind of creepy. Weird. It's like all snow covered up here. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Are those stars? This can't be stars, you can see them moving. Whoa, whoa, fog. That was weird. <laughs> I thought I was going on to snow, but it was fog. What is that? Like fairy dust or something? This is crazy. I don't want to go in there. <laughs> I want to disturb whatever ritual it is here. Look, we got like a, a stone circle here. It's probably like some sort of Neolithic stone circle here. It could be Bronze Age. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, what the heck is going on? Is this like a teleporter too? 
No, I think this is where I was. Maybe? Yeah. Cause, wait, is that the hill I came from? Yeah, cause there's those creepy circle of things. What the heck are these things? I haven't seen any. They're like birds. And the sun, what the heck is wrong with the sun now? What? So apparently the fairies or whatever, or the starlight makes it so that it changes day, back to day maybe? Can you do it into night as well? Maybe, ooh, I like insects. I'll follow you insects. Where are you taking me? Ooh, whoa, whoa, whoa. There's a house. Look, singing plants. Singing plants are always cool. Um, jumpy things? Jumpy things are cool, but I want to check out this house a little bit first. What's up with this house? It's all weird and random. Apparently you can't get in. It's not letting me in. Hmm. Space bar makes you sit, apparently. I may try that out. Taking me, guy. It's like a frog or a bunny or something. So, I'm gonna go back to those creepy statues. They might do something now that it's whatever today is. Plus, these are cool. These are clearly dividing um, ancient field systems. <laughs> These statues. I'm not even sure where that was. Maybe it's that hill? Okay. I was on that hill because that's where I saw that from. Let's head over there. Looks like it's going night time. Uh, apparently you can climb straight up hills. <laughs> oh, it's just a little slow. Where were those creepy things? Things turn to stone or something. That's pretty creepy. But uh, it doesn't look like they do anything. Oh, hey, look, the sun changed back to how it was. So, yeah, there's lots of weird crap on this island, apparently. Um. Hmm. Not really seeing like something I should be doing though. I mean these hmm maybe these teleporter things are linked somehow with something. It's really weird when my screen goes to black like that. It kind of freaks me out. But yeah, these things definitely teleport you. Or I don't know, maybe this is like a totally different island and it just looks like it's no, well maybe those are a different set of things but those are those look like those statues I saw over there so wait I think I teleported from that tower over to that tower right then interesting 
There's more of those birds. <sighs> well, if nothing else, this is a very relaxing game, other than kind of a vague air of creepiness. I think it just might be those. Whoa. Those weird statues. Oh, hey, wait. Oh, those, those are those fairy dust things. Ah. Oh, they're congregating again. Hmm. Maybe I'm supposed to stay and explore night more, night more though, and not make it daytime. It's got to be something with this. There's like some sort of nightly fairy circle thing. Okay, we got. We're gonna try this out again. We gotta go. Just starts like passing really quickly, and then even quicker as you go to the center. Wait a second. Okay, so no, it has several days passed. Uh, okay, I see. I think I see what's going on here. Okay, so that was like multiple days passing. So now this is like autumn, I think, and so. It like changes seasons. Look how much foggier it is. Wow, that's nice. It's like we're on some sort of Moorish area. Wow. So this must be the same island, but a different season. So that must have been what happened before. Like we had like spring, and then that last one was summer. That's why that sun was so blazing hot. And now we're in like an autumn, with, like really pretty trees. And so that must be maybe the progression they're talking about. So the next one's winter. And then it's just like this island that it changes season. It's just really relaxing and beautiful. Oh, it's kind of snowy up here, though. I may be missing something, though. Ah, oh, the creepy statues. I don't know if I've tried touching them yet. I don't know if I want to. These things are dang creepy. It's really quiet up here. Okay, let's go back down into the autumn forest. Maybe I can find some animals. Ooh, or maybe I should try to find that hut again. I think it's over that way somewhere. got a nice whoa low low quality aspect but still beautiful <laughs> I like the way the trees like dance I think it was over this way somewhere Ooh. hello What are these things? Is this the same stone circle? Yeah, it's supposed to be the same because I can see those friggin' statues up there still. Look at this low lying rain cloud. kind of 
not much out right now, but I guess everything's kind of preparing to hibernate or something. What are these things? Mushrooms? Hmm. Wish I could find that hut again. But I'm probably like wandering around in circles. <laughs> trying to kind of keep those statues somewhat nearby so I don't completely lose track of where I am. But it's hard in the dark. Oh, there it is. Or it's a hut. I don't know if it's the same one. I'm going to assume it's the same one. Anything happen in hut? Same old, same old. Okay, so it's getting to night time, so I'm guessing the fairies are going to come out again, or whatever. The lights. The lights are going to come out. And we're going to go to winter, I think. It's my guess. It's going to be all, like, snow-covered or something. Really beautiful. I like the winter. Ooh. It's already kind of wintry up here. Let's see, where are they though? I don't see them. Should be able to see them like congregating in the. Where's that stone circle? Okay, I need to not get lost. Hmm. Where is that stone circle? Oh, wait. Where are you guys heading to? This way? Yeah, looks like it's this way. Yep, okay. So they are congregating again. So let's head there and change it to winter. I think this might be the last one. Let's see. Yeah, let's do it. Um, okay, 